Yeah, Pierce should be. Yeah, this is this this was pretty much a five star. Yeah, five star. Five point two stars on a five star scale. Beautiful. And those those of you are like, oh really? Oh, let's buy it here. No, the entry was opening range highs. It's up fourteen percent now. You're chasing. The one minute opening range highs, where the hell were they? Well, that was too early, but you know, 360s, 370s, that was the entry. Too late now. Eidos, yeah, it's not as powerful, but yeah. Looks okay, but I I don't know. This is maybe three stars. Pierce was like literally five stars. AHT is another one is setting up. I really like this one. Hopefully can go side this for another one or two days. Yeah, CLSD, man. That one, that one was annoying for those of you who bought the EP. I, I mean, yeah, it shook you out yesterday, and now, <laughs> now, from those of you who got stopped out there in the like 360, it's up 60% since. Trading is so easy and uh, peaceful. GTX, yeah, looks pretty decent. Uh, POW is not good. There's no momentum in this thing. Focus on stocks that have momentum. Yeah, this Beyond Meat. Oh man, if we can tighten up for another day. GME. Oh yeah. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of these uh, meme stonks. Uh, bouncing. CLOV. Vish is the strongest one. Come on, AMC. Get your shit together. Volume is good. It's already above. Uh, no, sorry. Well, it, it's closing in on yesterday's volume. That's good. Very good. You don't always need volume, but. Volume is kind of nice, but you really don't need volume for a breakout. Breakouts can go... Sometimes the volume comes in late day. Carvana reminds me about W. It tried to break the range so many times and never went. It, it, you know, it needs some, like, uh, some type of news catalyst, like an EP or something to break out. They both look great on the weekly, but there, there needs to be a catalyst or something. Preferably earnings. Carvana, yeah, it's just a random range break. The entry would have been probably yesterday, but this is not a good setup in any, uh, in any, any way. This is not a stock you trade off the daily. It's something you trade off the weekly. Same thing with AMD. These are position trading names. Focus on the stuff that actually have some momentum. Focus on explosive stocks, high ADR stocks. This thing has an ADR of three. This is, this is, a, this is not a great swing trading stock. No, yes, it's been surfing the 50 day, it's been in higher lows. It's just a slow stock. Not good. Focus on fast moving stocks. Fast, high ADR. Five plus, five plus. EXPR, that's a good setup. <laughs> it's surfing the 20. It's, it's not a bad setup, man. Not a bad setup. PLCE, um, no. It's, it's no momentum here. I mean, like, I mean, yeah, these things can work, but you know, what, what, focus on the, you know, really super fundamental, super fundamental, super high, super momentum stocks. Focus on stuff like this, EXPR. Uh, you know, this thing doubled in a few days, you know. Obviously, this is depend. it's all the same theme, like stuff like Wish, it's building a flag here, right? You know, starting tomorrow, this would be a five-star setup. AHS, AHT, you know, th these are great setups. Something like, you know, f you know, don't trade mediocre stocks. Trade the explosive ones. Yeah, Pan W is amazing. I mean, this is amazing. Next leg up, it's gonna go to 500 plus. Um, it's it's a, such a slow stock, ADR 2.1, that's the problem. Workhorse? Yeah, that's a beautiful one too. Tomorrow it's gonna be five star, or four star. Four, or uh, you know what? You know what? Yeah, maybe five star. Snow is uh, digesting the weakness really well. Just right back into its range. If we can tighten up for a day and or two after this would be nice. B I I B. Yeah. Yeah, this could, could have a nice setup soon. This is a large cap stock. You know, very explosive. Also broke out of this uh, uh, seven year range. Not bad, not bad at all. Uh, no, sorry, 4th of June. Why? Why do you buy it there? Why? The entry was the 2nd of June. 
Why do you buy it here? Why do you buy it here? Here it was nice and tight. Here is wide and loose. They on meat. Bought it here. Actually, I bought it the same day too. I, I got stop. I, I didn't even stop. Uh, got stopped out. I just stopped myself out before it closed to free up buying power. It was a decent setup, but it's a better setup now. Um, Crocs. It, it didn't write any exits on this one, so I hope he's not still in it because it it it, it's, it would have stopped him out. It should have stopped him out. Crocs, no, ADR4, no, it's it's a it's a sloppy stock. This is not a swing trading stock. Wrong type of stock. No, 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 not a momentum leader. Seventh, nah, yeah, you know, okay, I mean, okay, nah, no, 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 no. Focus on the strong ones. Focus on the leaders. Flowers, seventh, that yeah, was a decent setup. He sold some here. That's good. That's good. Yeah, that was okay one. BW. Seventh? Oh, no, no, no. Horrible setup. No, no, no. And, and again, where's the momentum on this thing? This is sloppy stock. It's all over the place. It's, it looks like a barcode. It's not It's not a good stock to trade to begin with. And it wasn't a good setup. Space, uh, 7th of June. Let's see here. 7th of June. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay. I was a high momentum stock. Let's see, where did he enter? Uh, it doesn't say where he entered, but I guess he entered somewhere here, like low mid 32s or something. Uh, it was a decent setup. It was getting a bit extended. It had like a base here, base here, base here. But, you know, it's kind of working out for now. So that's good. LKCO. Nothing super great yet. Uh, but let's see. 8th of June. It, uh, again, this is just a random stock. Like it, it's it's you know where's the setup? Eight? Like why? Like what what is this? Like is it tight, nice and tight, or is it wide and loose? Or where's the range? It's just a random day on a random stock. Galt. Oh, barcode. Eighth of June. Yeah, no, guys, these microcap stocks once they lost the twenty day, they're done. Ignore. There's nothing there. There's no instant. There's no buying pressure on these things. These are just pump and dumps. Like there's no constant buying pressure on these things. Once they lose the twenty, they're done. Um, SMMT. Eight of okay. So this was a, a decent one. Had a nice move. Went up fifty-seven percent in a few days. Uh, started surfing the ten. Built higher lows. You know, nice triangle. Nice triangle. Tried to break out, but totally failed. Totally failed. But the setup was good. This is one of the better setups so far. It just didn't work out. Chris, uh, no. Um, I mean, I, I maybe, yeah, I see what you see, but uh, yeah, this is the same thing. Kind of tried to break out, then it reversed. NMRK. Oh, no, 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 2.9 ADR, you can, no, 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 just no. Where did you buy here? Yeah, no, it, it, it's just, it's not a, it's not a swing trading stock. Slow as hell, ignore this, you, you shouldn't be in this, something like this. You shouldn't even get something like this in your scans. Oh, hell. Uh, eight. How many trades did you do the 8th of June? Are you kidding me? Dude, you're trading way too much. You're gonna blow up. You're gonna blow up again. Like this is not a setup. Why? Why would you buy it here? Like it was a good idea. I know big move, but it needs to go sideways a bit more. Just let the ten day catch up. You know, let the ten day catch up. Don't don't be so eager to get in on some random stocks. Just let the setup develop. Okay, M O X C. Ooh, let's see, where is it here? That's a good setup. That was a good setup. Didn't have much follow through though, which, you know, that was a good setup. Uh, Zim, uh, again, we've talked about this stock before. It's it's not a great momentum stock. It's more of a grinder. Focus on the momentum leaders. This is a grinder. Very tough to try to uh, trade the grinder. Wait, did I sell CLF at the lows? Oh, fuck's sake, I hate my life. I hate my life. Okay, 9th of June. That was a five star setup. And if you're not a moron like me, you should probably be in it. I hate my life. X, that was a lagger, but yeah, it was a decent setup. Um, 
C and K. C and K. Let's see. Ninth. No, sorry. Uh, ninth. Uh, okay. I, I can already tell you like the set. Okay. I, yeah. Okay. Th this was a good setup. This was this was a great setup. It had been building this triangle, higher lows, lower highs, a tight range, two tight days, and then it had this range breakout. That was the entry, okay? This is a chaser's entry, not, 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 not ideal, not ideal, don't chase. It did work out, but this was the, this was the entry, focus on these ones. Um, this was more of a chaser's entry, it's working out, but... F uh, Legging, uh, ninth, uh, again, it's... Um, uh, too low ADR to begin with. Wait, G and K was too low too. No, that was 5.6. Um, what was it? Legion. Now, Legion today would be a much better setup. It found support on the rising 20. Had a tight day before. This w would be a much better setup than this. You always want to buy them when they're kind of bouncing off a moving average. If it's a 10 or a 20. Uh... Yeah, I mean, it was okay, but it, I don't know. Uh, let's see, Sig. Let's see, uh, 10th. Yeah, that was a good setup. It was an EP, and it's still working. Could go much higher. Billy. Uh, let's see, what? 10th? 10th, uh, tenth. not a good setup, no. ADR 3.8, you shouldn't be trading this thing. And it, there was no setup here, like, it's just a random update on a, you know, no. Doesn't look like a good setup at all. Uh, EXK, here. Oh, it's a silver stock. Yeah, it was a decent setup, it's just the silver trade didn't work out. HL, same thing, this uh, silver trade didn't work out. Uh, E-Man. Now, that was a good setup. Wait, you entered the 11th? Wait, why did you enter the 11th? The 12th, this day was the entry, 14th, this was the entry day. The 11th, you get, you, I think you anticipated it a little bit. You got bailed out on this anticipation, but you know, it, it, it works, it's working. Uh, BBW, uh, let's see, 11th, uh, yeah, again, you know, you're a little bit too eager to buy some of these. You can expect him to go to straight up. He would. This would be better if it, you know, let the twenty day catch up, have some build a new range, and then that would be a better setup. TGLS, uh, yeah, that was a better setup. Actually, started surfing the twenty, had a very nice range, just didn't work out. AMC, oh AMC, that this is uh, no, I don't care where you bought it. It was a good setup. AMC fourteenth, yeah, good setup, five star. Yep, great. I, I, nothing bad to say about this trade. A S X C um fourteenth again uh it's not a great setup you know you kinda have to let them build the range first you know don't buy just because it's building higher lows and it's just you know taking out the previous day's highs you know wait wait them for the developer range first let them develop an actual flag you're gonna have better success and also you're trading a lot you're taking a lot of trades it's not gonna end well if you keep taking these mediocre setups. Eidos too, I, again, like, let it build a range. Okay, there's no range here. Wait, let it go sideways a bit. Today was a good setup. It didn't look, it built several days of range, higher lows. Look at how tight it got on the 60. Like, look at, this is beautiful. Uh, 10, let's see, 15th. No, 14th? Again, you're anticipating stuff. You're anticipating, you, you know, you got bailed out on this one, but, you know, kind of anticipating. It wasn't a great setup. Here, oh, that, that was a great setup. Five star. I bought it. Five star, five star. Just didn't work out. Uh, Aram. Let's see, the 14th. I, again, dude, let the 10 day, the chill out with it. Don't buy this random you know, updates on a momentum star, you're gonna blow up. Just stop doing it. This is the, not a good setup. Let the range develop. Let the 10 day come, you know, catch up. Like I said before, if you can't draw a triangle, there's no setup. There's no setup. Now it would be, uh, you know, something. 
maybe for tomorrow, right? Now it's built some range. I wanted to buy shop, I just passed on it. And now it's building a Viagra candle, yeah. Classic, instead I bought the uh, Snappy Boy. And uh, you know what, it's gonna make a big move. It's just, uh, they're, they're messing around a little bit. It's gonna go, it's gonna go. It's gonna go to 100 before, I don't know, before summer is over. It's gonna go 100 plus, it, it, it's, it's getting there. RVLV. <sighs> Why didn't lose? I mean, it's not a. It's, it's again. It's a grinder. It's not really a momentum stock. It's it's more of a positioning stock. It's not a really good swing trading stock. Especially in right now, there's so many more explosive names. There's so many. But yeah, I mean, it was an okay setup. But nothing special. Nothing special. Sophie. Sophie. Yeah. Yeah. Not bad, yeah, it went, you know, it went up 60% in a couple of weeks. Orderly pullback, surfing the 20, getting a bit tighter, yeah, good one. Yes, 7.7 ADR, yes, very, very nice. This is a nice one. For tomorrow it would be like a four star setup, four and a half stars. 